Welcome to our channel UK Visa and Immigration Updates. Today we will cover the following topics. 1. What is an e-visa? 2. Who needs to get an e-visa? 3. Who does not need an e-visa? 4. What do legacy paper document holders need to do to get an e-visa? 5. What about passport endorsements, such as a wetting stamp, or sticker confirming indefinite leave to enter or remain. What is an e-visa? An e-visa is an electronic record of a person's immigration status. It removes the need for physical documents, such as the BRP, ink stamps, or VINIT visa stickers in passports, or the BRC. Customers can view their e-visa by logging into the view and proof service using their UKVI account and share relevant information about their status securely with third parties, such as employers or private service providers such as letting agencies. Who needs to get an e-visa? If you have a work, study or family visa, you will need to get an online status. Who does not need an e-visa? British passport holders, Irish citizens and customers who already have an e-visa, including anyone granted status through the EU settlement scheme, do not need to do anything. This is also the case if a customer holds both a physical document, such as a BRP, and an e-visa. Customers who are not sure if they already have a UKVI account, an e-visa can either visit www.gov.uk or refer to their original grant email or letter. What do legacy paper document holders need to do to get an e-visa? Customers who have indefinite leave to enter or indefinite leave to remain and prove their rights using a passport containing an ink stamp or VINIT visa sticker or use another type of legacy paper document should make a no time limit application. As part of the application process customers may need to travel to a UK visa and citizenship application services center to provide a photograph and in some cases provide fingerprints. Once an application has been processed successful no time limit applicants will be issued with a biometric residence permit which can then be used to prove the customer's rights and to create a UKVI account. By the end of 2024 no time limit applicants will receive an e-visa rather than a BRP. Further updates on this change will be available in due course. It is free to make a no time limit application and information on how to do so is available at www.gov.uk forward slash biometric dash residence dash permits forward slash replace dash visa dash BRP. What about passport endorsements, such as a wetting stamp or sticker confirming indefinite leave to enter or remain? The Home Office guidance advises wetting stamp or VINET sticker holders with indefinite leave to enter or remain to make a no time limit NTL application. A BRP is issued following this application. Once a BRP is issued, it will be possible to create a UKVI account and use the view and proof service to access the e-visa. To know the step-by-step -step guide on how to apply for e-visa, please visit our channel and watch this video. Please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell button to get timely notification of upcoming videos. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.